chocolate coffee. It is so warm. Look at that. This week, we're going to discuss the sin of gluttony, which is also and beautiful, soft, and warm. Oh my. It's I'm saying warm. there's going to be 10 folks. Here. Oh my. Mm -hmm. What about that? Strawberry cheesecake, it it's is. It's got a little vanilla wafer on the top. How mm -hmm. cute. Mm. So good. Look at that. I'm saying well, there's gonna be ten pork twirls. I'm gonna go back in on that. <laughs> Two. It's a double dip. Mm. Take gluttony seriously. And with the help of the Holy Spirit, be obedient. My name is Judy Rumschlaw, and Jesus is my Lord. Hey cookie. Cookies and cream. Cookies and cream. Cookies. You've got those hard edges. Yeah. No this hard is edges just here. Nice. <laughs> I imagine that's more simple. It's like a mix between an Oreo and a cinnamon roll. Or but Oreo like nut. So this is a maple cinnamon roll with maple glaze and crushed walnuts. Crushed walnuts. Deadly sin of gluttony. That's had quite a reaction from many of you. Uh, that's our topic as we continue the study in the seven deadly sins. I love that. Oh, forget about it. I'm so excited about this one. Who would be excited about a s'mores cinnamon roll? I like it. You ready for this? I'm ready. It was a habitual sin of gluttony. Hard edge. Nope. You've been looking too. And I found it, which is a, nice. I got a, I have a plain bite. Let me get a better bite. <laughs> okay. Whoa. You remember the game Candyland? First of all, check this out. I'm like a kid in a candy store. You have a little cookie on there. I have a little frosted animal, animal cracker. Who doesn't love animal crackers? I'm eating it. You gotta have them in your soup. There are times when God says to me, you know what? You can have that or you can be obedient. Oh, <laughs> well, if you put it that way, I guess I'd rather be obedient. Mm -hmm. Nice and soft and perfect. Oh. I love the smell of that. That is definitely nice and chocolatey. Yes. Oh, a big bite. Mm. <laughs> you did get a big bite there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That one. Mm -hmm. oh, that's a big fork twirl on that. I like this You're one going too. You're going both. Whole bunch of fries. That is a large. You don't need any Parmesan, anything. Let's try this. You ready? They don't overdo the powdered sugar. It's just so good. Guys, you don't have to get anything fancy dancy. Just get traditional French toast with the cinnamon butter. And oh my goodness gracious. Come on now. Come on. Really? Good. So here's the croissant. There's the ice cream. Lisa, you want dessert? Yes. Smear 
Irish burger. It's got two patties, uh, lettuce, um, yes. big old smash burger. It is good though. Mm -hmm. I can see that you like it. I like that. <laughs> you see how juicy it is there. Here we go. Dipping in the sheep crab poutine. Mm. <laughs> that gravy is so good. You can put that on. So how is that? Well, it's called sweet. <laughs> difficult time deciding what to get here today. Any good ramen, the key is that signature the broth. broth. Yes. So. Love because you love pork belly. And I think you really like mm. <laughs> pork belly from the look of things. Cured is the right word for that. We think it's normal because just so many Christians around us are doing it. And I fear that gluttony is in this category. Everything um, is piping, piping hot. Wow. On to the cruise. Mm -hmm. This is what the garlic bread. I like the gravy. Mm. Very good at it. Made for me and some bacon. Dawn's got her watermelon. A blueberry pancake, a donut, and some bacon. And so I have ham, tomato, mushroom, and um, cheddar We're talking sheet. about the deadly sin of gluttony. Go ahead, try it. Beets <laughs> and pumpkin seeds. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> uh-uh.